Coverage picks back up tonight with Fox 12's Drew Marine. And Drew, I understand you talked to some local pet owners about their plans to keep their pets cool in the heat. Yeah, most of the people we talked to today say they plan to take their dogs out early in the morning, or if it's just too hot, they're going to stay inside. It's finally summer in Portland, and we're about to see the hottest temps of the year so far. So how will people keep their pets safe during the heat wave? Well, if it's too hot, I will... Um, First of all, I won't take her out, or I'll try to stick to the shadows. She doesn't like booties, but if it comes to that, um, I might try to get some booties or something like that. While it's Dylan Morgan's first summer in town with his pup Maggie, he already has a plan to keep her cool indoors and outdoors. Maybe take the shades down um, if it's really too hot. Uh, make sure she has access to water. Um, other than that, maybe just we get a little spray bottle and spray her if she's really panting. But it's not Larry Powsland's first summer here. During the triple digit heat in 2021, he says they stayed in the AC and knows how to keep his dog safe. First of all, make sure she has a nice uh, cut for the summer. And she just had one today. And um, we always carry water for her. If we're going for walks, we go early in the morning before it gets too hot. Pet Samaritan's hospital manager Jennifer Robinson says there are plenty of things to do to keep your pets safe this weekend, like make sure they're in air conditioning, give them plenty of water, and avoid walks outside when the asphalt is too hot. While taking your pet for a swim in a river or a lake might seem like a perfect solution, she says do so with caution. But the water is cold, so the rivers and the lakes are cold, and your pet's body temperature runs around 103, 102 normally. And that's a shock to the system for them to be playing fetch in 50 degree water. So just be vigilant. If your pet is panting too much, starts vomiting or even collapses, Robinson says that's when you need to go to an emergency vet. Live in Northwest Portland, Drew Marine, Fox 12 Oregon.